Good morning, viewers. It's a new day. Welcome to today's devotion on Open Evans Daily Devotional Study Channel, a platform that brings you the Open Evans Devotional of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. Invite your family and friends. Get your Bible even as we read along today. Today's date, Thursday, November 2nd, 2023. Topic, Remember Me, Lord. Memory Verse, Psalm 106 verse 4. Remember me, O Lord, with the favor that Thou bearest unto Thy people, O visit me with Thy salvation, that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. Bible reading is taken from, Psalm 106 verses 4 to 5. Remember me, O Lord, with the favor that thou bearest unto thy people, O visit me with thy salvation. 5. That I may see the good of thy chosen, that I may rejoice in the gladness of thy nation, that I may glory with thine inheritance. Our topic once again is Remember Me Lord. Message Many times we pray and it seems like God cannot even hear our prayers, not to talk of answering them. We even see other people getting their prayers answered seemingly easily and wonder what our offense is that God has not answered us. In Genesis 30, the Bible says Rachel had no child for Jacob while Leah had birth child after child for him, even as she aged. It must have really seemed as if God was not hearing Rachel's prayers at all, but in verse 22, the Bible says, And God remembered Rachel, and God hearkened to her, and opened her womb. One major prayer point that you must pray when it seems like God is not hearing your prayer is, Remember me, O Lord. The first thing that happens when God remembers a person is that the fellow's prayer would be answered. If you have been praying for one miracle or the other and there has been no answer, God will remember you this month, in Jesus' name. Psalm 65 verse 2 says, O thou that nearest prayer, unto thee shall all flesh comes. God hears prayers but the Bible says that if he is to answer, there are certain conditions that must be satisfied. For example, in Isaiah 55 verse 6, the Bible says you must seek the Lord while he may be found and call on him while he is near. Thus you may have been praying for a while, not even sure whether he is near or not because you cannot see him, but when he chooses to remember, he himself would draw near to you. The second thing that happens whenever God remembers someone is that doors begin to open for the fellow. You may have been knocking on some doors that have stubbornly remained shut, but the one who remembered Rachel is he who has the key of David, when he opens, no man can shut and when he shuts, none can open according to, Revelation 3 verse 7. If the enemy has shut a door against you, in the name that is above every other, this very day, it will be opened. All you need is for God to remember you. The Lord will remember you today as you pray, in Jesus' name. Prayer Point Father, please remember me and answer my prayers today. Bible in One Year, John 3-4 Our hymn today is Hymn 15 Pass me not O gentle Saviour. Have a great day. See you tomorrow, God bless you. Pass me not O gentle Saviour. Hear my humble cry. Why Pass me by Let me add a thing
throne of mercy find a sweet relief kneeling there in deep contrition help my unbelief say